Lovely, thank you. And a tape. Oh, well, then there's. It took two and you to get it. It's not fair. He's got the amp. Line, it's 25 pound. Do you want to hold the line and just get your photo like that? Yeah. See, I don't want to stick it hook in it. I can try and lift it. Thank you very much. The knife and just cut it off. Good night. He's well hooked. He's not come off yet. Oh. Morning, everyone. We're off charter fishing in Channel Islands today. Off on a boat called out of the blue from a place called St. Peterport. Right, let's get going. Who's got a net? <laughs> yeah, first fish in the day. We haven't even started yet. I've already just got blonde grey next to the boat. That's got to be a good sign. Isn't it lovely that we go straight Some of the biggest species. Keep you updated as we get to the macro spot and uh, show you some of the scenery on the way. Got people fishing up there. Some people behind us. White rock over there. Let's go get some macro. Mackies. Big Mackies. I might stay before I might. That's a bad size
Give it a back oh, bit. Just, just back, crawl. back crawl and back crawl. <laughs> Okay, we're going to be targeting green in the next spot. Come for some scarlet pearls, which I've never tried before. One scarlet pearls, one Mackie. Yeah, it's the pressure. They don't cope too well with it. Yeah. Okay. Oh, there's a little bit of green. This is just cool. <laughs> nice and done, Laura. <laughs> there you go. Oh, 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 nearly. Oh, oh, oh. Yours is bigger. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
the paper as well. Lovely black rain. new species. I'm back there. It's not very big anyway. It's not quite as big, I'll put it in there. Yeah, still not too shabby. I've already got free bring that was a bit smaller so I'll put it in there. Sorry, do what? That's all right. I just uh, seem to be map filling it at the moment. Ooh. I've got some kind of yucky stuff on my hands. <laughs> oh, wow. Ooh. Oh, he gets very excited every time. Could be a keeper. Oh, it's like a red bream. Hold on, it's a red one. It's a big creature. Oh, it's a nice one. Big right? red bream. Don't lift it out of the water. That's a funky fish. Yeah. Ooh, <laughs> that's a special <laughs> fish. <laughs> and you got a shower from it. I did. Oh, oh what a lovely wow. fish. That's proper, that. That's proper. Would you like a photo with it? Oh, just you take the video. And oh, I yeah. am. It. It's still videoing. That's beautiful. Look at from the bite. <laughs> look at the beautiful blue band. Yeah, well, it's when, he, when they first come out of the water, look at the blue spots all around it. Wow. Try and get a picture without your fingers. Just try and lie your hands so you can see the fish more. Now tip it back a bit. Just want to keep it away from the side while I'm doing that. I'm just trying to get the glitter and the camera. Thank you. Sorry. Lovely. Don't go overboard. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Right. Oh, there's a husk yeah. and a tape. Right. Oh. Well then, lads. It took two of you to get him. It's not bad on a brain rig, is it? Yeah. Wow, more bait. Tactic a little bit, but for a much bigger single hook. 
um, on the stronger bit of trace with much bigger baits, hoping to get something more like a um, conga or a bull hus. Give it a go. Laura's got a conga. Oh, wow. oh hello. It's full of a line back too. Oh, that's a shark. That's a shark. <laughs> oh, this is. Now, isn't it? I think it's one we've had today. Oh, thank you, buddy. Oh, something very big. Conger. Oh, it's here. It's here. It's all bloody noise. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, but I'm going up the other end. That's a big conger. Line. That's 25 pounds. Do you want to hold the line just get your photo like that? Yeah. See, I don't want to stick a hook in it. I can try and extract you. Thank you very much. The knife from just cut it off. Well, looks, she's not come off yet. Oh. Wow. Oh. That's the biggest fish tonight. Oh, my goodness. Got him off down. That's a good 20, yeah? We're down here. Yeah, we're down here. Yeah, we're down here. Thank you, sorry. Rich. Eels living up to the name of rig wreckers. My lunch hand is going to be yours. Yeah. Okay, I'll get it. Let's go on. Okay, see you later, Peter. Thank you, Michael. And he's on. <laughs> Splashing you. Oh, that's a big fish. Oh, okay. That's sufficient, Danny. Let's get back to shore and let's have a look at some of these fish. Oh, 
hole that we're keeping. Also a lot, it's going to be safe for anyone else. And a lot went back. Okay, I thought I'd just head down, descale the fish, gut them, get their heads off down here. Another boat coming in the bear catch. Behind me. Perfect. Start with the one I'm most looking forward to getting cooked up. Still see that blue band. That's all deheaded, gutted and scaled. Right, now I'm gonna go and see if I can find the little lobs net I left down the end of the jetty. Swim down and see if I can find anything in it. If not, I'm gonna replace it with all the guts and heads that I've just taken off. The trap's just down off the end of the pier, so I'll go for try and find it. And then let you know if I've got anything. kind of crab. Oh. Two of them. Oh, called velvet swim crabs, otherwise known as lady crabs for their temper. That's the one that bit me yesterday. Lady oh, crabs. <laughs> Look at the teeth of them. He's beginning to think, hang on, I could do with a bit of bit of water. Oh hang on, you don't let me <laughs> Well, they look absolutely tiny compared to what we don't know that bite now. you do. <laughs> do they? Josh. Babies. Yeah, well, Laura's one was 25 pounds. Don't know that bite. So how much do you think those weigh then? Put it in the group chat. Look! Yeah, fresh bait afterwards. Whoa. Is there two in there or is there three? <laughs> There's two. I have an angry eel squirming towards. Yes, those lady crabs I'm all right about. Are they? They're Quite horrendously wild. ferocious. <laughs> I'm going to. There's three, there's three in there. There is, well. there is three congas. <laughs> such good friends with your buddies in here. Where's the other crab? Yeah. These things are just absolutely ferocious. This one's a ferocious one. That one, yeah, but this one won't be because it's got no claws because it's lost him in a fight. You can see if they've got red eyes, which is distinctive of the velvet swimming crab. Also, these paddles on the back, which makes them a swimming crab. What have we done, man? Number two. Don't 
Don't bite me, buddy. Can't say I blame him. Can't be really gentle with that. I lead the velvet swimming crowd. Right. Huh? No, that one's got claws on it. So happy where it is. So, where are you going to put that? Oh, good. Well, I think I might put it in the same place. Thank you very much. Don't do it. Right. Well. They are notoriously angry. Yeah, that is none of that. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, Why would you I'm going to chuck all the rest of the fish heads and guts back into the net. I'll tie it up again, chuck it out in the same spot, and then I'll take all the remaining fish back for the barbecue. All baited up, weighted down. So we'll get to the end of the pier again, chuck it off. We'll check it again tomorrow. This first one I took off, I wish I'd eaten a bit sooner because it's a bit lukewarm, but the taste is really nice. Okay, it's hot. Back That's we go. Hot. No, fair enough. Here you are, Thank you. I like it. It's nice though. The cooch is, has got lovely flavour and it is cooked very nicely. The same is a bit cold. <laughs> oh, it's okay. It's okay. I like the cooches actually. I really like that. Yeah. Uh, I know you're here. Yeah, yeah make sure you get the nice bit of the white fish. Um, is that the stuff you know, that you put? They are a lot worse yeah. than yeah. That's what I like. Yeah. yeah. It's not bad Quite actually. Meaty. And he's cooked it very well. Mm. Very oh, well. Imagine garlicky. Mm. <laughs> well, that was your fault. <laughs> Is it too garlicky? No, 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 no. <laughs> Sam and I would. Nice put... and garlicky. Sam and I have a very bad tendency of putting a lot of garlic on things. Garlic and chilli. Yeah. Can I put this in here? Right, well, that was a fantastic fishing trip. Really nice catch and cook. Didn't really get much of the catch and cook in. And the meat didn't look very nice looking back on the video. But yeah, some of that frame, the mackerel was really nice. Sadly, we're now back from Guernsey in the UK. And if you can't tell, our grass really needs cutting now. Um, but yeah, there is another Guernsey video coming up. There's a lot of foraging while I was out there as well. Uh, so in the next video there is going to be uh, lobsters, brown edible crabs, um, conger eels, catch and cook. We've got caught pelting and little traps that we're putting out. We've got quite an interesting video anyway. But I've got to say a big thanks to um, Big thanks to Richard on Alpha Blue. Really put us on the mark. Really good. Um, yeah, it was a really good place. I'm really quite sad to leave the beautiful place of Guernsey. I mean, it really is a stunningly beautiful place. And uh, yeah, leaving it, we left under grey skies and it felt a little bit sad. Um, but yeah, the weather out there looks beautiful now because uh, lots of the rest of my family out there. Anyway, foraging video will come. Uh, but yeah, if you have enjoyed it, remember to hit like and subscribe. Yeah, and hopefully we'll see you in the next one. Take it easy from all of us and the whole family.